Hello, I'm Representative Jennifer Pollack from Legislative District 13. As a classroom teacher and an instructor of pre-service teachers, properly funding Arizona's public schools has always been my top priority. This summer I was proud to help negotiate and pass a historic bipartisan state budget that allocated one billion new dollars in funding to our public schools. This was a unique opportunity to make investments in our kids that our constituents have been demanding for years. But there is one more hurdle that we must clear before schools can use all of the resources that we approved. We must vote to lift an arbitrary and outdated spending cap called the Aggregate Expenditure Limit, or AEL. The AEL works like an artificial lid that keeps our education funding near the bottom of the nation. This cap was established in 1980, and it does not allow adequate funding of the 21st century technology or the instructional needs of a nationally competitive public school system. Until we can reform it, we must waive it, or our district schools will not have the resources our students require. The consequences of failing to lift the AEL are unthinkable. Without a resolution passed by a two-thirds majority of the legislature, Arizona schools will be forced to cut 18%, or $1.39 billion, from their budgets this school year. My district includes schools in Chandler Unified and Gilbert Public Schools. They would be forced to cut $63.4 million and $48.5 million, respectively, if the AEL is not addressed prior to April 1st. It would force schools into layoffs, increase class sizes, and potentially cause school closures. The newly allocated resources are supposed to help our schools. Instead, we could take a giant step backwards. Please urge your state representatives, senators, and the governor to get back to work and waive the AEL for our kids. Thank you.